Hey, what's going on guys, Saad here and in this tutorial I'm gonna talking about the filtering and searching elements. So what we does, you know, the uh, we use to search things like our search engine and it will returns you that you, you need. So that means in contrast if we type something like tooth, uh, what is gonna do is give you this, only this and the others are gonna uh, remove. So for that to happen we need filter products what the heck where that come from yeah filter products and you know uh, we gonna filter all the products because these are products you know so let's begin and now do this so first what we need is bunch of spaces now we're gonna ask here saw why we need uh, so many spaces because a uh, human civilization hate to write in the last line line you know everything human civilized and hate is the last one so yeah farms and now what we gonna do is search products now you're gonna say yes what that is so uh, you know this one this ID this is the search products ID that means the content we are putting is I mean this one the content you're putting is none other than this so yeah this one and we gonna use the query selector again so you know we use the query selector a bunch of times so yeah and we gonna pass input that means now whatever type the here used it gonna give you a return here so let's put it inside a constant because we're not gonna use that again right so const search bar not big one as a small one search bar and here I use the camel quotation I already ever use everywhere the camel quotation you know that's the best way uh, you can describe yourself a programmer so search bar dot add even listener and throw key up and now what I'm gonna do is E and then use the arrow pen of function syntax and inside that what I'm gonna put is const const term so what that means you can ask that means the thing which is inside so uh, first I'm gonna show you what the event occurs so that way your concept will be clear so log it on a console e the event so key of event when we type anything it gonna trigger that event see anything so s I type sd 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 so SD 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 right and if it have a target here which is a input and we also have something called here um, let me show you that would be I guess yeah value the value is here so if we take the value by using uh, what we call uh, target dot value it can we can take that value inside right so target target dot value and then we gonna use the two uppercase I mean lowercase because now we're gonna ask why we need to do a lowercase because um, the, uh, if we don't do that uh, if we type tooth small in a small uh, case you know lower case uh, what is gonna do is it not gonna take this one because it's a upper case so that would be a big mess you know so what I'm gonna do all the thing I'm gonna change into a lower case and this one too so in that way everything gonna go well yeah you can also do the upper case but keep in mind uh, do the inputs and the uh, what we call the search items should be the same you know and uppercase 
I mean lowercase and then what we need to do is create a const and products it will be equals to your list dot get element by I their tag name not ID sorry about that though so elements by tag name so tag name and we're gonna pass a lie not lie a lie so when we do that after that what I'm gonna do use the array dot from you know uh, there is a uh, object called array or you can say constructor function from use the from it has a property products if you don't understand this things uh, I need to say that you need go watch my previous tutorials about draft the JavaScript or you can say each episode about JavaScript so this is what it does so each for each what it does it gonna call every function from the product you know we choose those one these ones you know the every single one of them and then what I'm gonna do is uh, it will equals to uh, use the L function syntax and after that I'm gonna put it on side uh, const you know I'll create a const which will be title I'm gonna name it as title and product dot yeah if you're if you're getting your um, out of your mind just go and check my old video I'm suggesting you and keep back watching you know like uh, it, it it would be hard for you if you don't know the concept what I'm doing so yeah that's for advice for you that's your opinion or you can understand by just looking at her first time that would be great I guess and then I'm gonna throw a if statement and the uh, condition is uh, very good I guess the condition is title dot to lowercase you know we gonna change the lowercase and what I'm gonna do index you know there is something called index of function so index of which go and as the name suggests it gonna find off index everything so e dot target and what index does is if that is doesn't it gonna returns one and if not then it will be minus one so to target dot value and after that if it's not equals to minus one uh, what it does is it gonna a uh, product uh, it gonna change the style of those so product style and which will be our, our is style or display which is changed into none so display equals to block you can change it check by CSS I already predefined it don't you worry about if you don't have a CSS good knowledge just check it out my CS tutorials you know I have everything or uh, you know I have uh, what we call uh, case for everything <laughs> lady though what the heck is just happening yeah I hope this will, uh, yeah and use the else as usual and product dot display uh, dot display Play what the heck style sorry about that the style dot display yeah and it would be equals to none right and 
then what I'm gonna do is here now let's do the search so don't wait there is a problem with the heck there's a bug in it let me find it for you products and alley from for each product is gonna check the title of the first element child and if the title lowercase I gonna index of the e dot value minus one and product data style a hey, way what Oh yeah, now I I get it. I call the forgot to call the function right. So yeah, now it's gonna work. Don't you worry. So T double O T H yes, it's working. And if uh, it, it, it even gonna work if you create a new element like um uh few bunch of L and just throw L L L. It gonna give you that. And yeah, how I edit works fine if you are thinking about editing something it's still gonna work you know so th this is the way it works like you edit it and and it is still gonna work so tooth tooth yeah so this is the way it works hope you guys understand that's it for today's video guys see you guys in the next tutorial